Here's how to create a plasma cutter using aluminum foil and 9 volt batteries. The materials you'll need are simple. A plastic container or bowl, four 9 volt batteries, two alligator clips, or if you don't have any like me, any two wires will work just fine, and a sheet of aluminum foil. You'll also need a stick of pencil lead, which you can get in a mechanical pencil, and I'm going to attach it to the end of one of these wires because that is what touches the aluminum foil. Then open the 9-volt batteries and connect them all together, snapping each battery into the next, alternating like this. You'll also need two rubber bands if you don't have alligator clips to connect the wires to the batteries. Stretch the rubber band over the top and bottom so it secures the wire to the battery. Now grab a piece of tape and use it to securely connect the pencil lead to the other end of one of the wires creating a mini lightsaber. Now place the aluminum foil over the top of the container or bowl, wrapping the extra foil around the sides. Grab the other wire and poke it through some of the foil on the side and let's see if it works. Now, I must admit, I was really confused why it wasn't working. I tested the wires on an LED light to see if the batteries even worked and they burned it out. So I tried more batteries and it almost worked but not quite. I even tried a regular pencil because maybe the thicker stick of lead would work better, but no. But then I thought the batteries might be the issue, so I bought some higher quality Duracell batteries. I connected them to the foil and wires, and sure enough, it worked like magic. Lesson learned, don't ever use cheap batteries. 